what is up guys i am back at starbucks and if you're wondering yes i did record this on the same day as the impossible sandwich i am going to review the pumpkin spice creme drink now a sad story about this one is i have gotten this drink before but i accidentally deleted the review that i did on it because i had edited another video on that same day and i did not associate that i had two videos because i never do that i usually film edit upload or at the very least film edit but upload at another time but yeah i lost that video and i was a sad cookie because my reaction was genuine so hopefully now that it's been a few weeks since that happened the memory has become a little vague maybe hopefully i can get that feeling back and talk with excitement about this item i cannot show you what it looks like for reasons that i'm sure you understand but i'm going to try to show you regardless it is orange and cinnamony yes and it smells amazing when you remove the lid do you guys ever get scared by lids like this sometimes i press on it and i have this anxiety that maybe i did not shut it properly and then as i drink i'm going to get bathed in whatever is in here which is usually chocolate or something with color and then ruin my clothes oh man that would be horrible all right let's have a sip yep this is exactly what I was looking for. So there is this pumpkin almond drink that I buy that is only seasonal. It's a shelf stable kind of milk. It comes in the little cartons. I kid you not, I have bought that. I have drank it at room temperature. I have drank it refrigerated after opening and consumed it. And I think when it's chilled, it's amazing. But I kid you not, it has never, ever, ever occurred to me to heat it up. Believe it or not. This is simply the hot version of that drink that I get. And with added cinnamon. Which I really don't think that it's necessary for this drink to have the cinnamon added. But maybe at Starbucks, they get the pumpkin drink plain. And then at the store, they have to add the cinnamon to it. But if you were to buy this drink without any cinnamon, that takes the spice away. So it wouldn't be pumpkin spice. So yeah, people lose their minds whenever it's the fall because... The pumpkin spice latte is finally around. And I'm like, forget the latte. Forget coffee. Let go of coffee. You people are being mentally controlled by that central nervous system stimulant. But anyways, guys, this is great. You guys should really try it. When I ordered it, the lady was like, just to make sure you're looking for the latte version or the one with an espresso, which espresso from what i hear really makes you fly and i said no i want the one that has no coffee in it and she was shocked because no one orders it and i'm like well i'm here to change that so maybe this serves as the base of the pumpkin spice latte so therefore since i'm ordering it without coffee I don't think this item will be discontinued because this is literally what they use for the latte. With the latte, you simply add the coffee element to it. Yeah. But this is so good alone. Even though it's hot, it has that creamy flavor, creamy taste. But while drinking it, it's like drinking tea. It's hot, but it feels watery. It's not like it's heavy or viscous in any way it's just perfect heated up milk with pumpkin all right guys well unfortunately i really don't have as much to say as the first time i tried this because once you have tried something it's difficult to get that emotion that you get the first time you discover something and you really like it 
I want to say that it's the third or fourth time in my time vlogging that I accidentally delete a video. Other things that I have done is I have accidentally deleted clips. So I have had to edit it in a way to where the context doesn't get lost. <laughs> and I guess that won't end anytime soon because mistakes happen. I'm not trying to pretend to be perfect. But yeah, you guys. Pumpkin creme. Are you into pumpkin drinks? Do you like the fall for pumpkin spice or is that just a girl thing i feel like i only hear girls talking about pumpkin spice maybe that's just a taste that you guys don't tend to gravitate toward because i know that your perception of taste differs a little from ours so maybe you wouldn't understand what the hype is but i would still encourage everybody to try this regardless all right guys well thanks so much for tuning in and i will see you soon